Hey everybody, Ann here. It's raining outside, so my hair is all wet. I got my spectacles on today, and check, check this out. Um, why can't I turn the camera around just like this? <laughs> oh well, here, let me show you. I found this homemade fishing pole made out of a barbecue something or other. Somebody put a nice big weight on it and a nice big hook. So I don't know, what do you think they're trying to catch? Not something that you keep casting out over and over again. Um, it looks like, this looks like something, I don't know, maybe to catch a catfish? So, I don't know. Hmm. <laughs> what do you think, guys? Should I try, should I try it? I don't know what to put on the hook. I don't have any bait. Hmm, gonna have to think on this. Okay, it looks like what I've got, because I did a quick search on YouTube, is a bank pole or a ditty pole. Um, I think the one that I've got though was used to catch maybe some smaller catfish because the bank poles and the ditty poles that I saw were, um, you know, the line they used were much bigger and the hooks were much bigger and they put like whole fish on the end of them. So this one's obviously much smaller, but I think it can work. And you know what, I think, I don't know, I think I know what I can use for the bait. Um, last night, well yesterday, yesterday after I arrived here, a uh, guy pulled up to my camp and he was getting ready to pull in front of my barn doors and I'm like, don't pull up here. And he's like, oh, it's so and so. And I'm like, oh, I recognize you. Yeah, I'm sorry, I didn't, I didn't know who you were at first. He says, come here. Um, and he motioned me over to the back of his car and um, he pulled out, he had cases and cases of Bob Evans bacon and sausage and gravy and um, he gave me two big things of thick cut bacon I'm like oh my god how am I gonna eat all this bacon um, and two different kinds of sausage one plain one sage and a couple things of um, the the Bob Evans gravy and I said where do you get this he says I just know people you know I got a whole semi full of them and I'm like hmm. whatever um, it's not even expired food <laughs> anything so I think what I'm gonna do is get some of that bacon and just put it all over that hook and throw it out in the water stick the pole in the bank <laughs> and just see what happens I don't know I've never done this before I have never done this before oh my god Betty. anyway wish, wish me luck okay and while we're waiting to see if I'm gonna catch a huge catfish this is my free dinner basically. Um, it's got, well, it's got bacon that I was given from my, my camping buddy guy, and it's got some of the sausage in there that he gave me too, one of the rolls of sausage. It's got beans I had, um, just a mixture of beans. I threw them all together, kidney maybe, and I don't know, pinto beans. Um, it has some of the tomatoes that I dehydrated, um, after last summer's crop and water seasoning salt pepper garlic it's got some uh, red pepper flakes I think some habanero flakes from when I grew habanero peppers and I dried them out crushed them and it's raining again so this is the perfect meal so thanks camper buddy guy um, this dinner is gonna be so delicious I cannot wait till it's done oh and towards the end I might throw a little bit of rice in um, I did soak the beans overnight uh, so that they would cook a little bit faster. And so we're going to let this cook for a while. And then at the end, I might throw in a little bit of rice. So, oh, and it's also got some cumin in it. Yeah, salt, pepper, garlic, cumin, uh, habanero pepper flakes, and I think that's it. Okay, folks, here it is. <laughs> the little pole that I'm going to try and get this on, on that hook. And I can't do it and film at the same time so I'll be right back <laughs> well I don't know I mean I, I think it looks okay right all right so let's take this out to the water and uh, cast it out I wish I had a GoPro or something okay well here's the bank I think that I'm going to throw it out here somewhere and um, I don't know, do you put it right close to the shore or kind of out there? I don't know. Um, so what I'm going to have to do is kind of unwind this, I guess, and then just take it and throw it out 
and then stick it in the ground. So I don't have any other way to do this other than turn the camera off and uh, let you know after I've done what I said that I was going to do. So alrighty, let me try this. I've got it thrown out there. I gave it plenty of line. And I discovered that, see that little stake down there? Well, it's attached to all this fishing line. So it looks like this is a good spot um, that maybe other people tried. So I've got it there. I hope I've got it in the ground good enough. And we'll see what happens. All right, it's looking good. Time for a little bit of rice because the beans are basically done. I'm really just going to throw in a couple of handfuls. I don't want to have to add any more fluid. I think that that is plenty. And stir it up a little bit. Let's see, let me see. Is that enough rice? Let's give it a little bit more. Maybe one more handful. God, there's going to be so much food. I'm going to go see if the camper dude is here and give him some if he wants it. I mean, he might not. All right, so let's just put the lid on this, let it cook for about 15 or 20 more minutes, and it'll be dinner time. And hopefully, I don't know if you can see it out there, my little deep pole, my bank pole <laughs> is out there, and hopefully I'll catch something. Okay, this looks done. I'm just gonna let it sit for a little bit. Um, let the sauce thicken up a little bit, let it cool down, plate it up, taste it, and I already know it's going to be really good. It's going to be delicious. All right, here we go. Let's see how this tastes. Let me get a little bit of each thing in it. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. It's delicious, of course. You know what I think I'm going to call this? Dirty rice and beans. Yeah, I think this earns the title of dirty rice and beans. It's delicious. Yes. Get up to make coffee and look who stole my spot. <laughs> Man, will you look at the weather? I swear. Well, my pole is still there. I don't know if you can see it. Let's see if I can zoom. Uh, it's really hard to see, but it is definitely still there. Because the camera's focusing on the water drops. <sighs> I don't know, maybe I'll just go out there with an umbrella and see if I got anything. I could just wait till it stops raining. I don't know if it's gonna stop raining. Well. I don't know, the suspense is building. <laughs> Whew, I just woke up, just made my coffee, haven't had any coffee yet. Um, so I better do that so I can talk and sound coherent. I'll be back. Guys, let's see if there is anything on the end of this pole. I don't know. It's looking pretty loose. The line looks loose, so let's see. It's kind of hard to do this, so. Nah, there's nothing. There couldn't be anything on it. my ass off if there's anything on it. I can just feel, it feels like it's just dragging, dragging on the bottom. Oh, I got it in some sticks now. Well, <clears throat> it looks like they really liked the bacon. So I don't know, should I try it again? Maybe I needed to throw it out further. Oh, I'm so bummed. I don't know, I may, 
I may try it again, I may not. I'm gonna have to think on this. Maybe I have something else I can put on there. I know I've got some catfish bait. Well, we'll see. But anyhow, yep, that's the pole. And uh, I think I'll try this again a little later. Well, better luck next time. Thanks for watching, everybody. Hope you enjoyed the video, and y'all have a good one.